All right. This time, I'm not even see. Ah, not so much. Okay, we're trying to go ahead and do is give you a chance to be able to see a little bit of exercise, a little stretch at the end of the day. I don't know if we're gonna have enough light. Up, oh, there's Rocky. What can you see? Not much, huh? Well, guys, I'm gonna try to do some exercise videos to give some people a chance to go ahead and get young again. Seems like a lot of people are interested, and there's not a lot of people out there trying to help them out. Just using some natural stretching and balance and diet. And so, I've got a few videos in the past. I haven't done any in a couple of years. And some people probably figure that, you know, if you get past your 60s, you're not going to do anything else. But I used to watch Jack LaLanne and think, wow, look at him. He can do all that stuff. So I want us to be able to do it too. But wanting and doing is another thing. So we're trying to go ahead and figure out a way to do this, get live, and be able to offer this up. Uh, Trinity is going to be doing the, the women ones. And I'm going to be trying to do some of the guys, older guys. Look at that, you actually see me. So we're going to try to teach some of the things like stretching and learning like the horse, which is simply a squat, and learning to build these quads up, and learning to go ahead and find a way to work the poisons out of the cells, not through blood flow, but through isometrics. Um, this is sort of a real good one for building your core. And people ask, well, how do you stay in shape? Walk, ground, get your feet, your bare feet or leather on the ground and be able to do that. Um, part of what this is all about, if you get this squat right, and it's supposed to be a little wider than your shoulders, um, and you want to hold that. You're going to find it burns a little bit, and you want to. It shows your willpower. Okay, and so your willpower is how long can you stay like that? You go, oh my God, I'm going to shake. And actually, if you follow the little routine, that I do, you can actually bring your feet a little closer together so that they're like this. And that one you go down and you bend forward and you're doing a number of different routines. So you're like that. And this is a really good one because you're doing like swimming. You do these. You see that? Yeah. And that's one of them. So you're swimming. I can, and the other one, you're pulling in. You can even rock a little bit. So you're pulling in at the core. Another one, you're doing woof, woof, and you do the wet breathing right in through the nose and burst out. Keeping this bent down if you can. And then another one you're gonna do, up in the hands in front of you, you're still down, you're going That's a good one. Another one is touching your butt. So you're doing backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards. So again, Backwards, forwards, backwards, forwards. Again, that's good. And then at the end of it, just hold that pose. Mm. Relax. Mm. What do you think? Ah. How's that for sunset stretch? Now you see, this thing we did, staying down like that, it's called the horse, martial arts, it's a training for building up those thighs. You're gonna know about that if you follow along with what I just did. That's about the end of the attention span for most people. Thank you, Delinda. Nice of you to join us and everybody else. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, yeah, Trinity does this. Hopefully she'll be doing a, tri a Trinity version, women version. It's done her a lot of good. I think it'll do a lot of you too. And I'm gonna try to do more of it because I need to get back in shape. 
you should be able to sit like this in this Asian squat and be able to hold this for long periods of time. They do it all around the world and it's a way to build up your core flexibility. Everybody says, oh my God, my knees and all that stuff. Well, if you don't take care of them, you're gonna lose them. Oh, this is part of a leg he's playing with. The sun's gone down a little bit now. Um, <laughs> hey, look at that, Marilyn Manifest. Good post, by the way. Good post. So, um, for the younger people, 50s, 40s, 30s, if you start doing this when you're young, you can compensate for all sorts of issues. You know, like broken backs, scoliosis, um, a lot of things like that. If you can go ahead and learn how to stretch the skidding up part, real important. Okay, when you stay down like this, when I was young they said don't bend your knees past that point. All over the world they do that. They bend their knees, they sit like this, they eat like this, they squat, they defecate, all those things in that position. In America, shoot, by the time you're 55 years old, you're not expected to go down low like this. Especially not for any period of time. Look at him. So, we've run out of time because everybody's going to be running away soon. So, thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming and visiting. Ah, Trini made it on. Look at that. We're going to try to do more of these. Maybe you can join me. Just watch this anytime and do this little setup I did. And then go online and do the longer version. That's just a piece of that workout. See y'all later. Thank you for coming. Bye.